I'm Daphne Thomas and I do the master program uh, GIS, which stands for Geographical Information Systems. Uh, my name is uh, Jeroen and I'm following the UniGS program. I work uh, currently for the Royal Netherlands Navy, and specifically for the uh, Netherlands Hydrographic Office, mainly as a hydrographer. There's a lot of overlap between GIS and hydrography. So basically when you learn the theory about GIS and also do the practical assignments, uh, then you really start to think about how can I use this knowledge in my day-to-day -day job. I work for uh, Wageningen Environmental Research and yeah, we are a research institute. I have to, for example, make a, yeah, a map visualization or an automated process. I decided to do this study because I actually wanted to become a better uh, GIS specialist. The, the average study load is about uh, 10 to 15 hours a week. It's quite a challenge, actually. However, I think if you're disciplined, uh, uh, do a lot of good time planning, then it's possible to do the course uh, besides a full-time job. It's an online study, so, so uh, it's, it's basically all besides your job. So I'm, I'm quite enjoying the, uh, the program. There's a lot of variety in the, in the program, different subjects, different fields. Uh, like uh, visualization, like geo design, like all kinds of stuff, which yeah, really uh, gives you the idea uh, to, to bring theory, to theory into practice. Sometimes you can actually use what you do at work also in your assignments. So that's that's actually yeah the perfect way, of course, to learn. The most important thing that I've learned was the more the scientific writing skills, um, and I, the study really focuses on. Yeah, that you that you are a good professional, of course, in GIS, but also that you have a, a proper scientific uh, foundation, actually, on how to write essays. Also on the innovation, they they think that's really important. And for me, that's also something really interesting because we also want to look at the future, of course. So the more innovative solutions, they also come along and. Um, I think that's really that's really interesting and really nice also. But for now, I think that's that using the knowledge obtained from the, from the masters uh, and using it to 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 evolve uh, 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 as a team, but also as an organization, and help the organization define strategy or a different strategy based on uh, all the knowledge I've obtained in this course would probably be the biggest goal for me.